Welcome to Silicon Valley Asian Business Talk. This is Raju Chen from Center for Business Studies and Innovation of Asia Pacific, University of San Francisco. Um, Mr. Lipo Tan, uh, we are very pleased and thank you for helping us to uh, do this interview program. Would you please uh, briefly introduce yourself? Sure. So I think thank you for inviting me. Uh, I'm an executive chairman of Caden Design and also chairman and founding managing partner of the Warden Group that include Warden International, Warden Catalyst, Celeste Capital. We manage about $5 billion of uh, asset under management. And um, I did my undergrad from uh, Nanyang Technology University in Physics. Then I did my graduate school at MIT, uh, Nuclear Engineering. And then I also did my MBA at uh, USF. Discussion topic, vision, trends and opportunities in different sectors. So what's your vision from your vintage point about uh, kind of like exciting new opportunities and, uh, you know, for entrepreneurs to know, you know, especially for young entrepreneurs to know about the future, you know, you talk about AI, AI, generate AI, those kind of things. Could you elaborate on your vision from your perspective, the exciting innovation, exciting opportunities? Yeah, I think it's very important to, you know, to identify the big trend. Mm. You know, the internet, you know, is a big trend. And then crowd is a big trend. Mm. And um, so you have to identify the call center, like they call it contact center is a big trend. And then generative AI is a big trend. You know, in fact, in general, AI is transforming all the different vertical industry is everywhere. So, and in fact, some of my, some of my friends, their kids, daughter or son asking me for advice. And I said, oh, well, if I were you, take some classes in computer science and AI, because whatever field you are in is changing. And uh, so AI machine learning, uh, I think it's not replacing an in, in, in the brain, but it's really helped a lot of industry to do a better job. And then secondly, you know, if you're in the software, right now the data is explosive and mm -hmm. uh, the data is massive. You know, just like autonomous driving, the data is humongous. And uh, so the data, the personalized data, how to secure that is a huge area. So to me, the, I call it the data flow software. The mm. software 2.0, you know, talk how to scale the, you know, to address all this massive data to make use of it. It becomes a very big area. And then the healthcare medical is a big area. How to use that, you know, become more personalized. You know, all the cancer, you know, every person, patient react to the medicine differently. And then mm -hmm. how do you use that in the AI machine learning to drive some of this discovery? And even some of the, you know, the mundane consumer product or retail, they are all using AI machining to drive better, you know, the more personalized, you know, like for example, people talk about TikTok, you know, TikTok actually the most advanced AI machine learning, even more yeah. advanced than Google and Facebook. Used to be their two of the best. And now TikTok is even higher than them now. And so again, you know, model keep changing. You just need to, you know, adopt and identify, I call it the major wave. And then uh, you just ride with the wave. So a little bit, a good friend of mine is a good server. You know, you surf only when the wave, big wave come. And then you ride with the wave and you make a lot of success company, but you don't try to create the wave, it, it won't work. So that's kind of my uh, metaphor that, you know, I believe that that very good friend of mine, he's a good um, a server. He said, a little wait for the wave, identify the wave. Thank you for watching.